seismic signals and fiery giants, a global look at eruption dynamics from Yellowstone to Etna and Campi Flegre. Correlation of local seismic activity with Old Faithful's eruptive behavior, hazard assessment and prediction. Deep beneath the E, steaming basins of Yellowstone National Park, seismic tremors echo through a complex hydrothermal labyrinth. Recent studies have unveiled a compelling correlation between micro-seismic activity and the eruption timing of Old Faithful Geyser, one of the planet's most iconic geothermal features. Seismographs positioned around the upper geyser basin record, subtle vibrations preceding each eruption, tiny earthquakes that signal the movement of pressurized fluids through subsurface fractures. Researchers have found that when local seismicity increases, Old Faithful's eruptions tend to become less predictable, with intervals stretching beyond the average 90-minute cycle. This link suggests a dynamic coupling between the Yellowstone hydrothermal system and regional crustal stress fields. By monitoring seismic swarms in real time, Scientists are developing early warning models capable of predicting shifts in geyser activity and potentially in the greater geothermal system that underlies one of the world's largest active volcanic calderas. While Old Faithful remains a tourist wonder, its subtle tremors serve as harbingers of deeper magmatic processes, making it both a natural clock and a barometer for Earth's hidden energy. The most violent eruption of Mount Etna since 2014. Across the Atlantic, on the island of Sicily, the ground shuddered under the fury of Mount Etna, Europe's most active volcano. In what experts now call the most violent eruption since 2014, Etna unleashed towering lava fountains that soared over 1,000 meters into the sky, accompanied by continuous thunder-like detonations that shook nearby villages. The eruption, triggered by rapid magma ascent through the central conduit, was characterized by intense strombolian activity evolving into a paroxysmal phase. Ash clouds rose more than 10 kilometers above sea level, disrupting air traffic and blanketing surrounding towns with fine volcanic dust. Thermal imagery captured by satellites revealed temperatures exceeding 1 200 degrees Celsius within the lava flows. The event served as a reminder that Etna, though often regarded as predictably active, still harbors the capacity for explosive episodes that test the limits of volcanic monitoring systems. Italian volcanologists from INGV, Istituto Nazionale, e di Geophysica e Vulcanologia, have since intensified their watch, noting a sustained uplift in the volcano's flanks and a continued emission of sulfur dioxide, a clear signal that Etna's magmatic system remains under immense pressure.
a violent eruption of Campi Flegre volcano is underway. Meanwhile, in southern Italy, the sleeping Campi Flegre caldera, a supervolcano whose last major eruption occurred nearly 500 years ago, has awakened with disturbing vigor. Seismic swarms rattled the region around Pozzuoli, followed by rapid ground uplift and intense fumarolic activity. In recent days, researchers confirmed what many feared. A friato magmatic eruption had begun near Solfatara crater. Explosions hurled blocks and ash, hundreds of meters high, driven by the violent interaction of magma and groundwater. The eruption marks a critical moment for volcanology. Campi Flagre, long considered a high-risk yet dormant system, is now showing sustained eruptive behavior. Gas emissions, rich in carbon dioxide, sulfur dioxide, and hydrogen sulfide, indicate fresh magma movement beneath the surface. Authorities have raised the alert to level four emergency initiating evacuations in the most vulnerable zones. The ongoing crisis underscores the need for integrated hazard forecasting, combining geodetic, seismic, and geochemical data to mitigate risk in one of Europe's most densely populated volcanic areas. Conclusion. Earth's pulse, humanities, challenge. From Yellowstone's rhythmic geyser tremors to Etna's incandescent fury and Campi Flagre's awakening roar, the planet reminds us that its heartbeat is both delicate and destructive. Seismic vibrations, whether subtle or cataclysmic, form a language scientists are only beginning to decode, a language that holds the key to predicting eruptions, safeguarding lives, and understanding the restless energy beneath our feet.